So, Peter, I had a real Malcolm in the Middle moment this morning. I don't know what that means. You don't I, have that many brothers. No, there's the scene of Malcolm in the Middle where he's like, oh, I gotta go change the light bulb, and then the ledge the light bulbs are on is loose. And then Brian he, Cranston has that moment. Yeah. Yeah. It's in Malcolm in the Middle. Yeah. No, I, I didn't know if it was Malcolm or if it was the dad. It's the dad. What's the dad's name? Is it Brian Cranston? I don't, I, it's Brian Cranston, yeah. I don't fucking know. So anyway, I went to I went to go uh, shut my... Sh I asked my dad for a, a new drill for Christmas, and he was like, listen, there's too many options. I'll just give you a gift card. And I was like, thanks, now I have to go buy my own drill. Which, like, I'm joking. So rude. It's like he doesn't even love you. <laughs> I can't make a joke about that! That's not fair! So I went out to I went to go take a shower this morning. I went to shut the bathroom door and it went like it like hit the frame slightly and didn't shut. And I was like the worst. I have to go fix the hinge on this fucking door frame. I'm gonna go buy that drill today. I guess it's like a one step Malcolm in the middle moment. It's not it's not close to the show. I take it back. It's stupid. It's close. Wait, so how is it like the show? You just had to go buy a drill. I you mean, just wanna brag about your drill. I bought two drills. But like, see, I don't trust a wireless drill. It always dies at the worst, like least opportune time. Okay, so that's true, but only if you get this baby battery for children, oh, which is okay. which is by okay. my budget was two hundred dollars, and instead of buying that, I also bought big fat battery Ooh, for that's adults. That's a big battery. That can hold a lot of electricity. It can, in fact, hold. Uh, this is 1.5 amp hours, and this is 4 amp hours. Whoa. That's almost three times. That's, that's, that is almost three times. <laughs> <laughs> I Welcome just, to the dad show. Welcome to the fucking dad show. We're, no one is pregnant. <laughs>talking about today it's a new year it's a, the same old you same old fat me what don't, are we talking? don't make me talk about goals and definitely goals. don't make me talk about last year's goals expectations don't. oh the fact that you're a big fat fucking liar is that what the listen it's not lying if you don't meet your goal it's just failing your goal lying to... <laughs> lying implies deception your goal was to play less games, and you played more than you've ever played before. I've played, like, 1.5 more than ever before. 1.5? Yeah. Like, times. Like, multiple. Like, 50% oh. more games. I was gonna say. You're yes, I like, played one and a half more games than I usually Your previous record of Platinums was, like, 38, and you got 64. Yeah. It was an unhealthy amount. What the fuck? Don't do it. Don't. Don't. Don't play that much don't don't play that many games. So what you're saying is you agree with the sentiment at the end of my video from two years ago. Oh yeah, you were right. Yeah. Yeah, you said don't do that. Don't don't get a plan. And then every you week. did it anyway. And then I did it anyway. See, here's the thing: it's like that wasn't the intention at the start of the year. Yeah. But like by April, it was like, oh, we're like on track. We should keep it up. And then you keep it up, and you're like, this, I've made a horrible mistake. You keep it up, and you're like, oh, I'm numb. Yeah. You're dead inside. It's not that is what fun. it is. It's not that fun. It's like here's why I hate goals, right? Yeah. Because goals are about looking forward. Goals are about thinking about the future, thinking about how you want to be better, and that sort of thing. I'm not a person who dreams about being better. I'm a person who's filled with regret and looking at the past <laughs> and be like, "Why did you do that, you idiot?" I look at myself in the mirror and I think, "What the fuck were you thinking?" You know what I don't regret? One of my goals in that video uh, was to platinum Deadbolt. You did? Nailed it. You did? did it. Nailed it. One of my goals in that video was if I platinumed Wolfenstein 2, the new Colossus, that you had to platinum Farpoint with me. Do you know how many times I, like, wanted to mention Wolfenstein 2 to you and then was like, no, you have to, you have to let him fail because there's no way I'm playing Farpoint. So this was obviously kept a secret until this exact moment was that... You don't have the Wolfenstein 2 platinum. I this don't. is a lie. I don't. <laughs> I was close... How were you close? No, shut up. Let me fucking finish. <laughs> I had had that as my goal, my secret pocket goal for plat 300 was Wolfenstein 2. That's a good 300th plat. Which is why near the end of the year, I was scrambling to try to get up to 299 before December 25th. Because in the video, you said, if you fucking pull out December 25th, oh, I got Wolfenstein 2. And I was like, I said I wouldn't do that to you. I had but 24. Like, December 24th would have been fine. I had two days when I was at like, I had, I had, 
I had tried to gauge, I was like, okay, I have like a week and a half to get four Platinums. And I think I got two, and I was like, nah, we'll push it off till next year. We're not going to get it. <sighs> so 300's Wolfenstein 2, the mystery is out. I told everybody I wouldn't tell them, I'm telling you now. I think 299, I'm at 298 right so now. So wait, 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 so now you're calling your shot, right? Yeah. What yeah. happens if you're trying to get it inside of a month, so that way you don't mess up our one Platinum a month thing, and it's not happening? So here's the thing, Peter. Right now, I already have a Platinum in January. And it okay. was a Backlog Platinum, per my own rules. The rules I've set for myself for this year, which I haven't said yet, is... We're not saying, we're not saying these are rules for everybody. These are just Will's rules for himself. Shut the fuck up. I have no idea what this rule is. Is this anybody watching this think they have to listen to my rules? Yes. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we're the, we're the deciders. We tell you what yeah. to do and you have to do it. Who are um, you to decide? Me. I am. I decide. <laughs> we, we, I decided this year I wanted to focus on backlog. I want to tr backlog is in games I've already started, not games I haven't started. I want to get to 90% completion, which is going to be around working on PS3 games. Recently, I finally finished Borderlands 2, which I've had on my account since college. Ever. College. Since ever. Like s nine years ago. So I want to I want to finish more PS3 games. I want to get you know my completion percentage up in the 90s to look like a big boy because everybody who's reputable has at least you know 90 percent. That can't be true. That's not there's got to be tons I of people with up. lower than 90 percent. <laughs> but so I want to do one backlog platinum a month, which is a game that's over two years old on my account, and well, it can be two backlogs. I want it, I want it to be two platinums a month for 24 minimum for the year. At least one backlog. They can be both backlog, but I don't have that many really old games. So yeah, like you're if, running out. You're so if I them off. if I do two in a month, I feel like I'll run out too quickly. But I already have one, which was I got it like I got Borderlands two January first at like four in the morning. Um, Damn. So Happy I I'm I'm one trophy. Shut up. I'm one trophy away from the forest. So that'll be my okay. second platinum for the that month. Game that'll, is that's bad. That's two ninety nine. I'm gonna get that probably in the next couple days, which gives me all of January to work on mine Laban. Okay. Which isn't the platinum for me, just like you. I have the collectibles to do after the fact. Okay. Then the collectibles for, are easy. So You'll if I get through. if I get mine Laban in January, I just have to get the rest in February and I'm gold. Okay, you're good. And no I, problem. Like, and I and I and I won't accidentally get a platinum three hundred between now and then because I'm like, how do you? F I mean, that's not gonna happen. Lock it in, guaranteed. Yep. Mine Laban in January. I'm not gonna lock. That's not fucking guaranteed. It's not guaranteed. Guaranteed, hundred percent, no doubt. I mean, you're the only person on the internet who got it in like twenty eight tries. Everybody else is like, oh, everybody else got it in like two. <laughs> I mean, Why am I so bad at games? I don't know, man. You're like, I got Meat Boy! I'm better than this! This is bullshit! <laughs> Man, if only I was that confident in myself, be like, I got Meat Boy! What am I doing? I don't even think about it. I I often have those thoughts when I'm, like, stuck on a game that's at, like, 35... You know, the average completion... Or the average Platinum is, like, 35% achieved. And I'm stuck on something. I'm like, I have fucking Surgeon Simulator. I'm not this shit at things. I have to be better than this. You and know what you... I discovered about myself this year? What's is up? playing horror games yeah i talk to myself a lot more than i do in any other genre like if i mess up in a survival horror game i'm like come on peter you can That's do better true. than that i was in chat with you and you did that and it was i audibly <laughs> laughed i was like are you talking to yourself right now <laughs> peter is your is your goal for the year to, to to get one horror game per month by the way i didn't say uh one backlog platinum or 100 percent because there's that too some games okay. don't have a platinum. I just I want to leave my doors it's open. True. I want to it's leave true. my options open. Yeah, because we don't we don't want to call you out at the end of the year for not getting your goal. That would be ridiculous. I mean, my goal last year was to play less games, and I played less games objectively. I completed my goal. Yeah, unlike some people. I think I think this year. So last year, I finally broke the dam, right? And I bought a seventy dollar game. I actually bought two seventy dollar games. I bought Ragnarok at seventy dollars. And Marvel's Midnight Sun. Dude, you $70. bought like five games a month for the like every month. Yeah, but almost all of them were indie games that were like ten or fifteen dollars. How'd that work out for you? Great, great. Honestly, I think last year was stop one of the better. Me, stop years making me of make this ever. face. 
Stop making me make the you're full of shit face. This isn't a full of shit face. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, last year, when we do the Game of the Year awards, it's going to be great. Every single one of my top ten is a banger. I have like eight more on top of that. You could also so make many a, bangers. You could make a top ten list of games that fucked you on trophies, couldn't you? That's true. It w- it's been a bad year for buggy trophies. Yeah. It, it is it because you bought wipe games saves, day one? It's some of them aren't patched yet. Some of them are still bugged. It's not a day one thing. It's just a we don't care about trophies thing. It's a real shame. It's a real shame. They hate us because they hate us. I don't fucking know. I don't know why. It only happened to me <laughs> once. We need a wall of shame for developers who don't give about give any hoots about trophies. Do I look like I have room? You have room. Okay. This is now the wall of shame. I know you've been people, saving that. <laughs> Go ahead. For people who don't care about trophies, but still make games that have trophies. I know you've been saving that wall for the one time we tweet something and like Kyle Bossman retweets it. You want to? You want <laughs> my idol? Right there? You want a frame right there? Well, there was exactly. the one time we tweeted at Skill Up and Skill Up like fucking hearted the tweet, and you were like, "Ah, senpai." <laughs> I think I think the hashtag I used was uh, shilling for shill up. That's true. You did like absolutely straight up. Be like, it was Daddy, bait. It was Daddy it noticed was bait me. to get him yeah, to retweet funny. it. Yeah, I mean, I don't want to say that like going in on your madness of buying all those games last year. So we didn't mention it in our goals last year video, but Peter. For Game of the Year's this last year, which we haven't come out with yet because people are busy and it's totally understandable. Uh, in years past, we it's like hard to make a top ten that doesn't involve a game we don't think earned it. Like, we don't ever play enough games in a year to say these are ten games I'm okay with saying were the best ten games we played. We end up playing like 15 games that were from a year. And it's like, well, I have to include, you know, seven of those are going to suck. So, well, I don't know if that's true. I think I think usually I get like nine really good games, and then yeah. I have that tenth slot that's like shout out a weird indie that I had fun with. Okay, my I mean, weird indies. I ranked everything I played this year. My weird indies don't start until like sixteen or seventeen. I like, think I think you you annually always play more games than me, and I don't. So for me, at least. In years past. More I new would, games. I, I play more new games than you. Yeah, by a sure. lot. But, so this last year, when you were like, here's a game, it's $25, and I was like, let's go. And I pulled the trigger. I think I played 19 games from this That's last year. That's still a lot. Which That's for lot me is way more than normal. So my bottom three and top ten are comfortable. I did not put a game in the top ten I didn't think deserved it. Nice. Usually in the past, I have to put a game. Like, remember the one year I gave, like, Pirate Warriors 4 was in my top ten? Whoa! I just thought of a goal for this year. What is it? This has nothing to do with video games. Go ahead. Do you know how good One Piece is? I'm aware <laughs> to a small degree, yes. I'm going to get caught up on One Piece. That's the goal. I know you can't see it because my camera's too low, so I might shift it up. Oh shit, it's not there. I took them down. I, I regret this. I'm editing this out. Never happened. <laughs> I put my deck boxes up along the top of my comic book shelf earlier. But I think the deck boxes for the One Piece card game. For the One Piece card game that we all have. Exactly. Uh, not yeah. sponsored. Not sponsored. Bandai, give us money. Good Good luck ever fucking Bandai? finding them. It's Bandai. Yeah, it's Bandai. Nailed it. Hold on, let me check. Because here's the thing. Here's the thing, right? Yeah, it's I Bandai. started reading One Piece in August. Yep. That's totally doable to get caught up. I'm more than halfway there. You, you were at like the... Th- 400 chapter mark and it was at the time maybe chapter 1068 was current and then like literally three days later you were like yeah i'm on like chapter 580 and i was like oh fuck yeah i'm in i'm in the 600s now baby yeah it's you're about to hit the stone wall that everybody hits and goes oh my god oh damn it the first stone wall thriller bark you made it you, you stopped at the first stone wall and you stopped exactly when most people stop okay well we'll push through it's what it is. Is this the balance then, of the universe? And then, we're, we're bringing it back to video games, One Piece Odyssey, coming out in just a few months. Uh, you definitely can't play it, unless you catch up. You're not my mom! 
You can play half of it. The second half of it is an arc you're not to yet. The, How can you know that? It's not out yet. How can you know that? I've seen a screenshot. Oh, okay. I, um... What the fuck was the segue? How did we fucking get here? Oh, right. Top 10 games that don't deserve it. Yeah, we... Because you played so many games last year, I was like, oh, I want to play some of the games that you're playing that are either co-op or just because it's like, you know what? We should play enough games together that the games that make the top 10 actually get points to have a chance at ever making number one. That it, does bug me about our top 10 list. Is like, the game that all three people played is the game wins. of the year. Yeah. And, like, recently, I would say the past two years, it's been not good. It's been, like, everyone's, like, fourth or fifth choice or, like, someone's unhappy or yeah. something like that. Like, I want, I'm aiming for, I got my eyes. I got my eyes set on it. I want, cross the board, all three people, unanimous decision, this is the game of the year. God of War Ragnarok. Everybody. It's gonna happen. It's not gonna you gotta happen. believe. It's not gonna happen. You gotta believe. It's what a debate. If you if you don't believe, it's not gonna happen. Yeah, I don't believe. <laughs> I'm one of the three people. Yeah, so you gotta believe. <laughs> nah, I don't have to do shit. Fuck you. So uh, so yeah, I think this year's top this year's game of the years is gonna be the best we've ever done. Because at least you and I don't talk. Probably... Don't talk. We haven't recorded it yet. <laughs> don't say things like that. It's gonna be great. <laughs> This is why I don't like goals. <laughs> My goal for this year is to make you really mad about goals, and I think I've okay. I've already I've already succeeded in that goal. I think. What's really mad? You just like. Where's the threshold from mad to really mad? You just like turn your broadcast off and just like walk out. Of, you just like walk out of the room. Take your headphones off and walk out of the room. Okay, we'll get there at some point this year. Okay. What would it take? Gotta get really mad about goals. Is it just about goals or about anything? I thought it was about anything. About anything. It can be about anything. Whatever. Okay. I'll try to figure out something. I can probably piss you off. <laughs> All right, I think one of our other goals is to uh, not make a goal to make a consistent video series and then name it after the consistency of the video series and then stop being consistent about that consistent video series. Are we still, are we renaming Bi-Weekly Breakdown? No, we're going to keep calling it that, but I think we can name it that as a meme. Because some people... See, here's what you want to do with YouTube. We right? have branding, bro. I'm not going to change Here's what you want to do with YouTube. Give you want to me. confuse your audience as much as possible. That's true. I mean, we can try to make these every two weeks like we did last year for about eight months until we both fell off a fucking planet. It was not eight months. It was Seven like three months. months. No, it, it was, was like three months. We made it to like June or July, and then I went we to Brazil, did not. and I went to Arizona, and then I went to North Carolina, and then I went to Philadelphia. Okay, I had we a lot did of work not trips. Three months. I had a lot of work trips. It's not my fault. It might be my fault. It's probably my fault. You got to believe. You got to believe, is. Peter. We've got we've we've covered a lot of topics today. We covered. <laughs> did drill, we drills? Drills. Did you actually have a goal, or did I talk about my goals and then you just... Went, I have yep. no goals. I'm just... I'm a free spirit. I have channel goals. I'm not sharing them. I'm not be. I'm not letting people hold that against me. Okay. Fair enough. No. I do want to make more Tales of Platinums, though. Last year, I wanted to make one every month, and it didn't happen. I think we made... Five? Five, six? six. Yeah. Something like that? That's I, half. I think the problem was we... This is, this is a discussion that we shouldn't have on a video like this. <laughs> is 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 a thing I would say, but I would talk to you about it in a, in another forum format. <laughs> um, I think my goal for the year is I want to watch all of the West Wing. That's a good goal. These that's are a non, good show. These are non gaming goals. We both. That's have. a good. That's a good goal. You're gonna catch up on One Piece, and I'm gonna watch all of the West Wing. Because it's not like there's any good games coming out this year. Resident Evil 4 Remake. That's oh, yeah. I, I have money. That's a good game. That. I was given a gift with the stipulation of you can only spend this money on Resident Evil 4. That's a good game. Time it out. It's going to be good. Are we buying any games in like the next two months? Resident Evil 4 Remake. Isn't that out in March? It's out in March. Just because there's like a billion games out in February, like in the same week, and everyone keeps talking about how crazy February is. And I feel like. Everybody keeps talking about how I'm crazy February is. Games. I've looked at the list. 
It's not that crazy. What am I missing? I mean, the only, like, big name one is what? It's the Hogwarts game, right? It's a Hogwarts game, which I'm not going to get at day one. No. Because it's it looks like it looks poopy, right? I'm so happy you said that. It looks bad. It looks I'm, not good. I'm convinced that it's not going to be that good. Maybe it, maybe it'll turn me around, but right now it doesn't look good. <laughs> January the gameplay is just okay. It seems maybe dated a little bit. The story outright seems bad. I'll go that far. Okay. Hogwarts Legacy, PlayStation VR 2, Horizon yes. VR, Octopath yes. Traveler 2, Destiny 2 Expansion. Oh, Like a That's Dragon. It? Like a Dragon Ishin, which is the one where you're in old-timey Japan. Looks dope. That looks cool. I that probably won't get cool. it, though. Resident Evil 4 is March 24th. It's a good game. It's a good game. Hogwarts Legacy PS5 is in February, but Hogwarts Legacy PS4 is in April. Yeah, they delayed the last gen version. Star Trek Resurgence? What about Star Trek VR 2? Bridge is Crew! It on, is it on VR 2? No, I don't know. I have to... I, pff, You're just fun. making stuff up. You're just coming on the internet and telling lies. I said Star Trek Resurgence. Why isn't it Star Trek Bridge Crew 2? Is what I want, personally. I don't know, man. What are we talking about? Are we ending this? This is dumb. Wrap it up. I don't want What's to... the number one game you're excited for? Maybe, it's going to be RE4, but maybe Suicide Squad Kills the Justice League kind of has my attention. It does look good. Better than Gotham Knights. What was the indie game that I found the other day that I sent you? The Tactics Wizards game? That looks good. Oh, the, the One Room Invisible Ink game with wizards? Yeah, that game looks dope. That does look good. Tactics I would, Battle Wizards? Yeah. Something like I, that? I would watch you play that and then shout encouragement and not play that, it myself. That get, you're, you're playing like an xcom one one-room uh, fight, but it's with wizards, and your wizards also have guns in addition to spells. That sounds so cool. That's just like guns with extra steps as spells. Just shoot. Yeah. Them. It's dope. It does look dope. I'm excited. Did you hear how I said I'm excited with, like, the most dismissing tone? Oh, yeah. Simple? Yeah, I, I'm picking up what you're putting down. I got it's you. It's a fucking tactics game, man. I guess I'm excited for you. Give me a game where I'm the guy with the gun and go... Do, 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 do. Yes, yes. Yeah, it's Wolfenstein 2. You heard it here first. Our first uh, Tales of Platinum review where I did Wolfenstein 2 years ago and now Dibble will do a video on it committed here on this video he you said it you heard it another him. Tales of Platinum on a game we've already done yeah that's actually almost good enough of a bit that I would probably commit to it that's actually really <laughs> stupid and I kind of want to do it people are Again, like it. <laughs> confuse already, the audience didn't you already do this what are you talking about I've never done this Okay, well, that's fine. All right, bye. <laughs> <laughs>